Hey, hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. My name is Kelsey and around here we talk primarily about Young Living, essential oils, and the majority of their products. Today I'm going to be sharing with you my May monthly wellness box or my Young Living essential rewards order. It's kind of like a subscription box, but way better. I choose every product that goes into the box, making all of the ditching and switching and maintaining of this lifestyle a whole lot easier. This order was pretty small, but it's very mighty for me. Um, so to start off with, I re-upped my Ningxia, which you can already tell this bottle is like empty. Oh, not empty, but you know, basically as soon as you open it, you might as well consider it empty. Ningxia Red is jam-packed with so much nutrients and anti and like tons of antioxidants and it's it's energizing and it's fortifying and it's revitalizing and it's probably one of my favorite Young Living products if I were completely honest with you. Um, you'll notice at the bottom there's kind of like where it settles. It just settles down at the bottom. This is cold. It came straight out of the refrigerator. Um, and so you shake it up to get all the goodness throughout the whole bottle and you can see that it kind of changed colors a little bit there. I am obsessed with Ningxia. I, I love all the other Ningxia products, not just this, but it makes sense for me and my lifestyle to always order the two pack of the Ningxia. I say that this order is small but mighty because the Ningxia Red makes up for the majority of the cost of the order. So if it wasn't for the Ningxia, I probably would have had like three or four other things. But I ordered Ningxia and um, I will say that's around $73 wholesale. So definitely higher on the end. But if you split it, if you divide that by the two of them, I think it's pretty fair. Um, and so funny story. <laughs> I also ordered some deodorant, but I've been using it, and the little cover came off. So this is the Mountain Mint deodorant. It's my absolute favorite. Um, but if I remember correctly, I think they're going to be discontinuing this product, so it doesn't really matter that it's missing the label anyway. Um, but yeah, that's awkward. It smells great. Like it's very minty and it's absolutely perfect for me because I like having that cooling sensation under my arms. I know it's kind of weird, um, but I love the Mountain Mint deodorant and I'm so sad to see it going. And the other goodie that I got was something that I've kind of been waiting for for a while um, and I really wasn't sure if they were gonna come out with more um, types or versions of their mascara. They finally did, they came out with a lengthening mascara. Maybe it'll focus, maybe not. Uh, nope, it won't do it. Oh well, I tried. Um, so they came out with a lengthening mascara. I am absolutely in love. You can't really tell right now. I mean it. They look fair. They look a little longer. I, I have really thin, super blonde eyelashes, so I have to wear mascara in order to even look remotely like I'm a girl. Um, <laughs> so I, I have loved this lengthening mascara so far. I really like the brush. Um, so it's actually one of the stiffer bristle, like rubber plastic brushes. Um, I'm still not gonna focus, is it? But so you can kind of, you can kind of see it. There we go. Ah. Fabulous. So it's got some stiffer bristles. Um, and I really like that. I've always liked brushes like that because it really combs through my lashes and spaces them out. Um, I think I did kind of gunk a little bit on today, so it's not nearly as thin and pretty and feathery like you would normally like on your makeup. Anyway, but I am obsessed with this. They also came out with a thickening mascara. So they've got a thickening and they've got a lengthening. I went with the lengthening because I feel like when my eyelashes are longer, they just look better. Um, and of course, I still have my other tube of the regular one. So if I wanted to, I could layer it. And that was kind of the idea behind the formula of this lengthening one is that you can add on layers to get it to be longer too. And then of course, to conclude your order, you've got a freebie. So this month, uh, well, this month, the month of May, <laughs> we got a longevity vitality oil. This is something that I have not tried, um, but I've heard really, really good things about it. It includes thyme, orange, clove, and frankincense. And I don't know about you, but I love to like take frankincense. I love to 
put frankincense under my tongue. If I wake up and I'm feeling cruddy in the morning, I like to put a little frankincense on a spoonful of honey. I love frankincense. <laughs> And I know that's like one of those things where people are like, oh, like you, you take the oils like in your mouth. Yeah, I do. <laughs> so I, I love the taste of frankincense. It's, it's kind of bitter, but I just, I don't know. Y'all, there's something special about frankincense and like the connection that you have to like God and and your just overall spiritual relationship. But longevity is supposed to be really, really good for you, so I'm excited to try it. So in conclusion of the monthly wellness box order, I love to share just a smidge about why this is all so possible for me. Um, in the grand scheme of things, I would be spending all of the money that I spend on these products on something else somewhere else. Um, instead of buying two or three different kinds of mascara, I have one. Instead of buying, you know, a bunch of different good for you drinks, I buy one. And when you consider the way that you add all of those things up and you're like, oh, I got this and I got this and I got this and I wanted to try this foundation and I wanted to try this concealer, whatever. When you add it all up, you're spending almost the same amount of money. But at least this way, I'm getting really good products, ones that I know I'm gonna use, ones that I know that I'm consistent with using, and it makes a huge difference for me. Not to mention, every time I place one of these orders, I start to earn points, which relates to my, you know, points orders that I make. Uh, you've seen me, I, I place $300 value orders for absolutely free because I save up all of these points for months at a time. Um, typically I try to do those orders about every year and when I wait that long, I get to spend $300 the majority of the time on free products. Like, you guys. <laughs> Being able to do that really opens you up to this lifestyle. And I know that a lot of people are like, oh, but I don't wanna have to, I don't wanna have to make that order every single month. Well, you don't have to. You really, I mean, you don't have to. But it's so worth it when you do. It makes a huge difference. And honestly, the, the, like the, like the maximum, well, the minimum that you spend is $50. If you can't easily go to Target and spend $50, there's something wrong with you. Um, that's for one. <laughs> I hardly ever get out of Target without spending $50. So if you can give up your one trip to Target to order things that are good for you, you're not trying hard enough. It's all you have to spend. Like that's 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 the bottom line requirement. Fifty dollars, fifty dollars every month. You absolutely spend that every month on anything that you enjoy, and then in the long run, you're saving up the points from these orders. And okay, so if you spend a hundred dollars, right? Say you spend hundred. Let's, let's go a little extra. Say you spend a hundred dollars. You're gonna get starting off 10 of that $100 back. So that means that every time you spend $50, you get $5 back in points, five, $5, okay? That's spectacular because, okay, five times 12. You know how much you're gonna be able to spend for free? You're gonna be able to spend $60 if you get $5 a month. So as soon as your one year's up, you get $60 worth of free stuff on top of all the stuff that you already ordered for yourself. And you know, sometimes if you spend a little extra, you get some freebies and sometimes, you know, heck, maybe you have a friend who decides that they love Young Living too because they see what you're doing and they see how good you're looking and they see how healthy you're looking and how happy you're looking. They're gonna wanna be a part of that and then they're gonna sign up and you're gonna get a $50 bonus which means that you get $50 to spend on Young Living or to make up for that one month that you didn't get to go get your caramel macchiato at Starbucks, okay? Okay, all right, see, it's not that hard. It's not that hard and there are rewards and there are benefits to being a part of a program like this. You don't have to get the same stuff every month. You don't have to keep products in your house in order to be a Young Living member and to have an income from this. The whole idea behind Young Living to me is that I don't have to have a product stock to 
like sell or promote or whatever. Anyway, going off on a tangent, thank y'all for tuning in. Oh my gosh. I am so excited to be back into this video thing and sharing with you guys and just being a part of this community. If you ever have any questions, feel free to comment down below. I do my darndest to keep up with the comments. Um, even if it is like two or three months later, I will respond, I promise. Um, <laughs> at least as of right now, while my channel is in the beginning stages of growth and development, I will continue to try to share with you guys and to respond. If you haven't already, go and check out my Instagram. I am always trying to share little bitty tidbits about Young Living and my lifestyle over there, um, as well as more about myself, which I'm hoping to eventually transition into sharing more about myself, my personal life, and my passions over here on YouTube. So bear with me, be patient, and eventually we will get there. Thank you all so much for tuning in. Much love, you guys. Bye. Let's do the math. Five times 12, y'all. I don't know math. I'm going go with me. It's just on point. Like, I just, I love my difference. Anyway, um, making it awkward now. No. <laughs>